Hey Scrappers, Tom from iScrap and I want to go over stainless steel. What it is, where you can find it, who uses it, and areas that you may not even think about looking for stainless. Now stainless is an item that's used not only in the residential sector, but also in the commercial sector in many different ways. How many of you have walked into a public restroom, go into the handicap stall because there's a little more room, and what do you see on the wall? You see a handle. This is made of stainless steel when you use the magnet. Stainless does not stick to magnets. If you listen real quick, it has a real high pitch to it. So when you use stainless and you're looking to learn what it is, non-magnetic, very bright and silvery in color, and when you stick, you can hear that high pitch sometimes. That gives you a really good indicator. When you compare stainless steel to aluminum, just listen to the sound. It's a little different. The aluminum is a little more dull sounding, but this is an area that you may see not only in a hospital or a public restroom. Some people even have them in their home, so watch out for these handles. Next, you have a flex hose. Again, does not stick to the magnet. These flex hoses can be used to connect the ovens and they have gas going through them. Also different gas grills can use these. This can be found both residentially and commercially. Next up, your pots and pans. Hey, let's go make some spaghetti. You got this strainer and look what you got. More stainless steel. This could again be found both residentially and commercially, whether in kitchens or in your own home. Stainless steel is able to absorb the heat, get the water hot when you're cooking it, and also in the medical industry, it's able to really be a very strong metal that doesn't have a very high volatility when it comes to temperature. It holds cold and hot incorrectly, and it gives you a better idea. Other places that you can find stainless steel, stainless steel refrigerators, often have panels that are made of stainless, grills, and a lot of other areas. So hopefully this gives you an idea of what stainless steel is. Remember, have your magnet handy. It should never stick to stainless steel, which contains some nickel inside of it. And make sure you ask your scrap here about the different grades of stainless steel, and that could be another topic we talk about on a different day. Thanks for checking out this scrap video. For more exclusive scrap video content, please become a YouTube member of our channel today. Thank you and I'll scrap you later.